All right. Now let's go ahead and inspect the repository where this data is downloaded. That's in a folder. So this data is available here, COVID-19 pre-process data set. And there I'm going to show you in inside a pre-process. So inside a pre-process, we have these four files. And in these four files, we are having, let me open this one. So the country day wise CSV. So there we have country confirmed cases, deaths recover, active new cases, new deaths and the new recoveries for all these countries. And this data set starts from 22 January, that's 22nd January. All right. And then there is latest data available for today. It's 9th of, it's 9th of May. All right. Perfect. Now let's go ahead, close this one. And uh, sorry, I think uh, I don't need to save it. Anyway, so we have here another one. That's the clean version. So this clean version is a clean version of time series data, which is available at John Hopkins university all right so there we have this data and one thing you notice here that uh, there is a time uh, two different time formats are here but not to worry all these formats are handled automatically in other files and these will not create any problem and uh, then it has total day by day cases for all these dates so today we have here 9th of may all right, and uh, the two extra columns is available in this file, which is longitude, latitude and longitude, which is a coordinate so that we can also find out the coordinates of that country or the province or state. And then we have here day wise cases. So this day wise cases is um, total the cases to that particular day for all the countries together. So it says that on the 22nd January, there were six countries affected from COVID and those countries, affected countries kept constantly increasing and currently it is now around 187 countries where COVID-19 cases are registered. All right, perfect. So these are the data set which we are going to, which we are going to read in our this uh, python notebook so let's go ahead in this jupyter read those data set in this jupyter notebook so the first of all i'm going to read that clean version of the data set that i can read with df is equal to pd dot read underscore csv and it is inside covid19 pre-process data set and then there we have a pre-processed and then finally we have there COVID-19 data cleaned.csv. And I'm going to use here parse date so that I can parse the first column as a date. I mean a date column is there. So this will be parsed as a date. All right. And if you run it and you see that DF here, you will see. So this is the first column, first column is parsed as a date. And there is other columns as well. The one thing you should also notice here is that there is an AN values in province and states. So these are the none values. So we need to also handle those none values. And those none values we can handle simply by changing here df province and state is equal to df province state dot fill na and inside that I'm going to fill here empty strings. All right. So now you see this is clean version of the data. All right. So as we imported this clean version of the data, now we need to also import other data you see there is other data as well like country day wise country wise and the day wise so we'll be importing these data in the next lesson so thanks for watching this lesson i'll see you in next one